False advertisement. They say this shit works in the fucking movies. Oh, finally light. Marlou! Hey Marlou! Hey Marlou! Where the fuck? Oh, oh, there's just a note out here. No wind blew it away or anything, just... Okay. Dear Shane Dawson look-alike. Uh, okay. We took your boyfriend, so if you want him back, go to this address. Oh, he's one of those bad guys. Okay. <laughs> Maybe they don't speak human? Marlo, what did you do? <laughs> Actually, it was me. That was dramatic. Anyways, who are you? The name's Virgo, an old friend of Marlo. He's in trouble. Big trouble. How big? Pretty fucking big. He fucked with the wrong people this time. The biggest GCC in the universe and galaxy alone. Oh, shit. So, that's what we've been fighting. Everyone's been saying GCC, by the way. What does that stand for? Galaxy Control Center. These fools thought it would be cool to own a whole galaxy. So, they went and did it. And when did that all start? 1602. First, it was Adon Hendrix, being the founder of trying to own the moon. And then it was his kid's idea to own the sun. And then they wanted to go bigger and bigger. And now they own the whole galaxy. Jesus, dude. Not to be too insane and dry here, but you know your stuff. Of course I do. I'll be fighting these assholes for years. Oh, so you have history with these guys, huh? Too much history. Oh, so who's that fellow with the long octo arms? Oh, Guagar? Yep. He's the latest founder of that poison environment what they so-call to be a center portrayed by meaningful alien fucks. Roofs are covered by minority freaks. So, to be straightforward with you, how do we actually get them? That question is way easier to say than to do. Quite frankly, I've been trying that for years. But from experience, you know how to infiltrate that place. You know the ins and outs. Correct. But, I'm only one man. And one man can't stop that poison. But you must have at least one plan. Like, come on now. What do you think, Bumblebee? B bumblebee I'm sorry? Of course I do! Of course I have a plan. God damn. That's why I was in contact with Marlo for the past month. I knew those sketchy fuckers were trying to target him down. That's their only weakness. Marlo. So you're saying Marlo is in their home base, getting tortured right now? Well, they know Marlo is smart, so they can't hurt him, but he will come back even stronger. Let's go. Wait, 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 what? Where? Go where? They're their own base. Come on. Uh, all right. <laughs> so, we finally caught you. The devil himself has been caught in my traps. <laughs> you even know yourself, Quagar. He said finally, as in, like, finally, we've caught this son of a bitch. Like, <laughs> um, I'm sorry, I'm the son of a bitch here? Really? These Ancomnics know my rights, so never trust who you think is not your friend. Wh what? What's there? What are you looking at? <laughs> oh, <laughs> sorry. I'm just trying to think of what you, uh, you said. Yeah, I... Yeah, no. No, it doesn't make sense. So you said never trust who you think is not your friend. Yeah, no. 
No, I don't know. I, I'm just, my mind is fuzzled right now. <laughs> Trying to work that out, you know. <laughs> so, you, are you saying, like, uh, forget it. Okay, this place stinks like a hospital, but someone poured loads of fish juice around the floors. Ugh, Jesus. Oh, for Christ's sake. Listen, we just want to know who you are. Oh, so I'm a threat to you, am I? Well, not exactly. I, I wouldn't say that. I'd say you're more of a burden. <laughs> so a threat? <laughs> Whatever. Lock him up. Ask him questions. I don't care. I'll be back in T minus 16 minutes. Oddly specific, but. Okay. <laughs> Wait, what? How did he do that? Hey, put down the item! <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. You guys didn't know? Simulated room. Whoa, big mind fuck right there. <laughs> Ugh. God, I love myself. Not to be too cocky, but... Dude, I honestly can't with myself sometimes. I don't get paid enough for this. You guys get paid? I did this shit for free. <clears throat> Anyways. Night night. <laughs> uh, I always feel sick when they go back in. <laughs> uh, go back in. Non-sexually. Oh shit! There he is! Marlo, are you alright? <laughs> Am I alright, the boy says. Long time no see, brother. Virgo, is that you, you son of a gun? <laughs> nice new purple outfit. I like it. Yeah, I made it myself in my workshop. Nice, nice. That's what every hero needs. No, no, Marlo, I've told you a lot of times. I'm a vigilante. There's a difference. Alright, come on, boys and girls. Let's quickly go. We only have two minutes before Guagar comes back. Actually, he weirdly said he will take 16 minutes. Don't know why. And don't know why T minus part, but fuck it, let's go. See, I never get the logic to these types of tech. Shouldn't we be getting sucked out right now? Nah, there's an oxygen orb around the base. Have they fucking done that? I'll never know. I've showed you how to do this many times, Steve. You never listen. Ugh, finally, back home. I know, just gives us a good rest for our next mission. Next mission? Wait, we will still have to deal with these guys? Oh my lord, of course we do. I know you don't know this, Steve, but that Guagar guy that you ran away from and saw for like 10 seconds, he's a crazy bastard. There will still be more of this. Sadly. Oh, trust me, I know he's crazy. I can fucking tell. Listen, boys, if we all die, then just know we didn't go out with a fight. We were strong. Exactly. That's the spirit. I like this guy, Marlo. Uh, yeah. Yeah, sure. I guess that's true in technical terms. Ugh. Uh, but listen, we're all gonna go back home to Earth and just live. We'll fight when they come around. We won't go near them. Alright, you hear me? Seems fair in my books. I mean, it's not like I don't want to fight anyone. I need my rest after a long, stressful day. Thanks for lending me this. This will come in handy. No problem, buddy. Hey, hit me up sometime. Of course. Oh, Marlo. What is it, Steve? I literally just cut this grass last week. Oh, now it's all ruined. Dude, I'm sorry. It's not my fault that their cargo ships have literally blasting turbo boosters right underneath. Anyways, I'll be in my room chilling if you need me. Oh, right. I'll be lying my sloppy ass all over the couch if you need me. Alrighty!